My process was a little different than the, the average person's process. Uh, I started as a sophomore, which is really early in the game. Um, and from there, you can't really do much. You, uh, you just kind of try to stay in shape and uh, try to get physically where you're supposed to be. But once uh, the application season starts rolling around, um, I started with applying to their summer leadership program. Um, and from there, my application had already kind of started. Um, after that, there's some essays you have to write. Uh, you have to ask for, for different levels of recommendations. Um, you submit those to, to different nominating sources, like um, Vice President, um, both Senators, uh, our Congresswoman Axne. Uh, from there, then, uh, generally it happens, uh, you get a nomination uh, from one of them, and then, they, then you're eligible to be looked at from one of the service academies. Originally, I was looking into being a pilot because I felt I was probably uh, the best way to become an astronaut. Um, and but I, so I decided. Well, I don't even know if I'm if I'm going to enjoy flying. So why not uh, look into a private pilot's license? So because if I if I'm working through my private pilot's license, I absolutely hate it. Then I know I'm not going to be a pilot. Um, but now that I've flown a little bit, I really enjoy it. Uh, it's a it's a sort of sense of freedom that you I mean you can't really find anywhere else. Um, and the more I've flown, the more I realize I want to fly faster. So it's kind of like I don't know. I want Every day at work does feel like an adventure, I guess, and I think I think flying would be would be the best way to do that. So I'm I'm thrilled. I've been working on it for a few years now, so it's it's really good to like I was I used to like literally have dreams about receiving uh, receiving the appointment, and so when I did, it was kind of at first I was a little numb. I didn't I wasn't like I wasn't it was kind of hard to believe, I guess, um, but now it's kind of it's 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 coming. To, to realization, like I'm leaving late June, so I don't have a whole lot of time at home left. So it's kind of like, okay, I'm gonna enjoy kind of the last last few months I have, and then um, I'm, I'm, yeah, I'm ready for the for the new adventure that's gonna be it's gonna be called. So the thing I, I've I've probably gained most from uh, from RTC is uh, because uh, I applied for leadership positions, um, and then I worked and then got leadership positions. It helped me learn, I guess, how to lead um, and how to um, interact with all different types of people. I want to thank Santa Colonel Bishop, uh, my mom and my dad, because uh, both of them had to be all in to, for me to be all in.